Country 96, real country variety where bigger is better. Joined on the line by Kiefer from Thompson Square. And before we get into the interview and talking about your year and the show you've got coming up here soon at the Gasconade County Fair, I just saw on Twitter that you guys actually blew a tire recently. Is everything okay? <laughs> yeah, it just, it just happened a few minutes ago. Uh, I got Sean out there changing it right now. She's doing good. Oh, nice. So uh, you do the phone interviews <laughs> and uh, you put her out to work. Yeah, yeah. And then we broke my bow net. Uh, yeah, I mean, I said, you know, I said, you know, a dog and, and, uh, heard this really loud noise and, uh, we just blew a tire. And according to one of our, uh, fans on Facebook, uh, we just added a second trailer with the second bus. And so we're, we're renting this second, uh, trailer. We didn't buy it. We're only going to use it for a short time. And, uh, evidently, uh, someone said, well, no one of your tires with us, the cheapest tire on the market. <laughs> maybe but time to, uh, figure. maybe time to upgrade the tire then, I guess. Yeah, maybe so. Well, uh, you guys have had an amazing 2012. The year is only half over, and you guys have uh, won a CMT award. You're nominated for a bunch of other things. From your perspective, how has the year been for you guys so far? What do you really, how do you deal with everything? Well, I mean, I, after having a song, it kissed me and come out and, and do what it did, and then I got you, and uh, you, you kind of wonder, you know, is that, is that it? Is, you know, can it get any better than this? And It's just, we've been, it's been very blessed, man. I, I mean, I just can't. Uh, it's, it's really hard for me and Sean to put our head around what's happened to us and what continues to happen. And, you know, we just got some great fans out there. And, uh, you know, radio's embraced our music. And we just, uh, that's just changed everything for us, you know. And I don't know, you know, just 2012 has been an amazing year, you know. And it just, hopefully it just continues. I mean, we're just, we're out here working our guts out, trying to maintain what's going on and, and, and bring our music to the masses and working on a new record and stuff. So, we're just going to keep on doing it as long as you guys play it. As long as everybody wants to hear it, we'll, we'll keep singing. Yeah, well, I have a feeling you guys won't have to worry about that too much. Now, you've been out on the road throughout the summer with Lady A. You've got a few shows with Rascal Flatts. How has the summer been so far? How are things going? Well, we actually, uh, we've been on tour with Lady A all year. And uh, we're only doing a couple of dates uh, on the Rascal Flatts tour. Uh, I'm looking for filling in for somebody. I'm not sure. But uh, we've known those guys for a while. And we're doing, I think we're doing tonight in Houston. Uh, this weekend, and then we're done with those guys, and uh, for pretty much for the rest of the year, we're just doing our own shows, so tonight's got to be fun, though, man, we enjoy you know, it, we grew up in the same place, and, and uh, we know each other from back in Oklahoma, and so it's going to be cool to hang out with him a little bit, but we're looking forward to the show tonight, they're going to be our first, tour, first day on tour with him. Now, how would you describe the uh, the difference between, say, doing your own show, and then going on, opening up for Lady A or Rascal Flatts, what is the difference there? You know, obviously, we're, we're not quite at that level, so there's definitely a lot more people there. But, you know, we played, uh, you know, we played uh, in Kansas City last night, and, uh, you know, about 5,000 people showed up to the outdoor show. And, uh, you know, the, I think the major difference is is when you're the, the only act there and 5,000 people show up, they're there to see you. So chances are they know your music and everything else, and, and they were insane last night. It was just absolutely absurd. And as, as, uh, as the songs, you know, get higher and higher, you know, going out on tour with these other guys, it's really cool because people are starting to show up earlier and earlier and not just coming to see, you know, Lady A or Ask Flats or whatever. You know, they're coming there a little bit early to see the, the opening act and the middle act. So that that's really cool. You know, another major difference is, I mean, you got you got nice catering and you got all these, you got masseuse and all the stuff on, on staff and everything at the big tours, you know, and we're not quite there. My masseuse is Shauna, you know, so <laughs> we're not quite there yet. So there's definitely a lot of perks that uh, come along with being on a, a major tour with some of these people like like Rascal and, and uh, Lady A. But, uh, you know, it's the crowds are smaller, obviously, when we do our own shows, but man, they're, they're very intense and it's just, we have a great time. And, and uh, you know, I'm, we we like to, we like doing our own shows because you know we get to do seventy you know sixty to seventy five minutes you know and that's that gets us you know we get warmed up we get into it we have fun the, the crowd's rocking when you're the opener act uh, you know like old lady A and Jason Aldean last year we did twenty minutes so you don't even break a sweat and you're done so that's 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 the hard part about it I, I, I like doing the long shows so if you had the choice between doing your own shows all the time or being an opener you would choose to do your own right. Well, you know, just, you, know you, you have to have both of them, you know. I mean, you, we've been very fortunate to be on uh, two major tours this last two years, and, you know, without those tours, you can't expose yourself to, to a different audience, you know. I mean, people uh, you know, are still learning who Thompson Square is, so, uh, you know, that's why you get on these big tours, to You know, the Lady A crowd and the Jason Aldean crowd are two different crowds, you know, and that's, uh, that, that's, that's why they have opening acts to come out and help sell tickets but also to help, you know, to help develop these new artists, you know. And I can't say that 
I prefer one over the other because you definitely have to have both, and we're very grateful to be uh, to be able to be on tour with those guys because that's really changed a lot uh, a lot of you know the success that we've had and exposure to new fans and and friends. It came from those major tours that we couldn't have you know you know we we can't put twenty thirty thousand people in a room right now. So that's that's definitely changed everything for us, and you know, and hopefully we pick up a few people from all those tour dates that we're doing with those guys, and then you know they start coming to our shows. And that's just how the train gets built. And how exciting is it going to be for you when you're doing your own shows and you actually get to be the ones bringing opening acts with you? Oh, it's going to be great. You know, that's 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 the the end goal. You know, the, that all artists have is to head on their own tour. So uh, we're really looking forward to that. That's going to be a, that's going to be a blast. Hopefully, we'll, we'll be able to change some lives like those guys did us. Now, you and Shauna actually have your own show coming up Saturday at the Gascony County Fair. What can the Country ninety six listeners expect from a Thompson Square show on Saturday? Well, it's a lot of fun. You know, we uh, as soon as we got uh, off the of Monday tour. Um, we revamped our whole stage. We had some staging built. We added lights, a bunch of lights. We added a lighting director and a B3 play. Uh, and so we're we're definitely reinvesting in our in our business and uh, you know trying to give our our fans the best thing for their buck. So you know, it's, you know we're going to have fun. It's going to be high energy and, and the band rocks out and, and uh, it's not going to be a boring married couple show. We sit there and watch two people sing love songs to each other all night. I mean, we like to have fun. It's going to be a fun night this Saturday at the Gasconade County Fair and. Uh, Maybe now you can jump out and help Shauna replace that tire on the bus, huh? <laughs> I think she's done it now. <laughs> I'm going back to bed. <laughs> All right, get some sleep, and we'll see you on Saturday. Kiefer, thanks for calling in. Thank you, man. Talk to you soon.